and here are uh, Winifred's puppies. Just over six weeks. Everybody's 18. There's red ribbon and brown ribbon on the ends. And I have been doing a lot of research lately on the Lifelong Vitality supplements, um, giving them to dogs. And there is a heck of a lot of people doing this and it is absolutely showing incredible results. Um, so if you want the best form of supplementation for your dogs, I would really give Lifelong Vitality from doTERRA a shot. Um, and of course the, the whole science behind that is this, the essential oils inside the Lifelong Vitality. Um, that's what penetrates the cell wall and causes maximum absorption. So the bioavailability of the whole food nutrients and the vitamins and minerals are actually fully absorbable and utilized by the, the body. So um, I'm going to start this in my herd and um, I would love to pass along this information to all of my puppy clients because we want to do the very, very best for our dogs and give them the longest uh, life possible. Anyway, I thought you guys would like just a little bird's eye view of what they look like when they're eating. Yeah, they're eating in a little saucer. Call it the, um, the flying saucer thing. And they usually don't climb into it, so it's a great way to feed when you have a lot of puppies at once. <laughs> and that is um, Green Ribbon. His name is Theodore. And Purple Ribbon right there is Brutus. And they have all really mastered the dog door. So nobody is pooping inside the kennel anymore. Um, they're still peeing in here, so they're still not fully with it that way. But there's literally no poops inside here. They go out their doggy door. And that's Brown Ribbon over there. He's had enough. See, his stomach is the size of a cannonball. And Red, who his name is Boris. Love that. And um, our little princess there. I, I still haven't heard what you guys are going to call her. You might not have decided. Nope, brown is back for more. Or not brown. Um, Brown's name is Ernie. Yes. I remembered. So there's Ernie coming back for more. And Green Ribbon, who is Theodore. And they named him, I think they said King of the Baguette, which is hysterical. I love that. And Lauren, I'm, you might have told me what you're going to name him, but I forgot. So remind me. I'm trying to get used to their new names. <laughs> Hi, Miss. <laughs> That's purple. <laughs> Brutus. <laughs> Hi, Brutus. <laughs> Hi, Brutus. <laughs> oh, he wants me to play with him so bad. So great. <laughs> so if you guys have not decided on what you want to do about um, the essential oils and how much I recommend you do this. You will save so much on vet bills um, because you will have you'll be empowered to treat your own um, dogs when issues come up. So it's really really liberating. So let me help you. Let me know what you want to do as far as moving forward with the kit. Um, and I am here as your advocate, teaching you everything you will possibly need to know on how to utilize these oils. And you can do it just like I do it. In fact, just as an example, Garth, the daddy of this litter, got in a huge fight with a raccoon, had puncture wounds all over him. Um, this was about 10 days ago. <clears throat> and I have fully, fully treated him just with essential oils uh, using an antibiotic blend. And he is healing up perfectly. So uh, I, you know, I don't mess around with risking anything with my dogs. I fully am reliant on 
these essential oils using them as plant medicine. Um, but that does not mean that I will not go to the vet. I absolutely do. And thank God for my veterinarian. But when I can handle things on my own, I certainly go that route. <laughs> okay, it's just a little extra video. Oh, somebody just went out the doggy door and I didn't keep the camera on it. I'm pretty sure that was Red Ribbon who went directly out of the doggy door because... Oh no, there's red. So it was brown. It was um, Ernie. Ernie went out the dog door because we've got purple, we've got Brutus, we've got Theo, we've got female princess, and red ribbon still here. So it was it was um, Ernie. Okay, guys. <laughs> Bye, pups. Bye, babies.